finally finished building it. Now we're gonna test it with water. This is a full build. We just turn this valve here to access the gas, open this, and then we pull the trigger and blast. Just a few safety features here. You can't shoot it, this thing is down, so it's kind of like a safety. You should put it down. It's nice and snug. And this test isn't going to have a nozzle that we're going to put on later, so it won't shoot to its furthest potential right now. Oh yeah! Oh, oh, oh. For my first flamethrower test, I want to make sure there are no risks of setting the lawn on fire. So I'm going to water down the grass and plants and have two men with a hose and fire extinguisher ready. This is where I'm going to be firing from. It's close to the pool and I can extinguish any fire on me if needed. As an even further precaution, I'm going to soak myself and keep a cool fire resistant layer during the test. This will minimize any chances of burn injuries to myself. From water testing, I know the fire will shoot roughly 15 meters, which doesn't expand past the pool area. Remember, don't try this at home. This was done under the supervision of an engineer, and many safety precautions were taken. Okay.